Okay, this time we have uh, Jacob Boatman and Shailen Raider. Now, uh, Shailen Raider has fought for CFX before. He fought last time against um, Kyle Jensen. Kyle Jensen. And got killed. He did get killed. Jensen came out with uh, his first time being at 155 and was out to uh, prove a point. And he did just that, um, beating Shailen in uh, 30 seconds. Just, it was, it was, it was good. It was good. Good fight for uh, for him. And then we got Volkman on the other hand, who uh, his first fight in uh, in the cage. He's outstanding, three-time All-American, Division One for the uh, University of Minnesota, and this will be his first fight. And he's looking to impose his will as well. Shailen just buckles and tries to pull guard. It doesn't do a very good job of doing that. And look at Volkman with knee mount showing a little jiu-jitsu skills. Great knee mount. Now Shailen actually holds a title. Shailen does. He he's the EFX. Uh, 155 pound champion, which is the biggest fight organization in Minnesota. Um, so he is their uh, their belt holder, and uh, he's Jacob his, Volkman is this is he's 0 and 0. Volkman is 0 and 0, but one of the better athletes to uh, come out of Minnesota um, in some time, and he's just uh, imposing his will and some body shots after body shots. Where does Jacob train out of? Uh, Jacob trains at a Minnesota Martial Arts Academy, so with Sean Shrake and, and all the bad boys. And he also uh, he trains uh, he trains uh, with the U of M still. He still goes back there and wrestles and uh, trains at a high level there. Um, so he's he's always busy. This guy is uh, very very uh, aggressive in the training room as well. He's going to be he's going to be the next big thing, I believe. I really truly believe that Volkman is on his way. Um, to get get places and to make money in this sport. Not too many people I say that about because it is such a hard sport to go anywhere in. But I think he's got all the tools and the right attitude and, and, and all the work good weight, the 155, and he could probably even make a 145. Well, this weight here is 170. They weighed in at 170. They both, uh, neither one of them wanted to cut any weight at all. Um, so, and there, uh, Aaron looks like he's going to stand this fight up. I'm not sure why. Um, Shailen was taking some hard shots to the body. And uh, yeah, and I thought uh, we're not, Tom over there is wondering what just happened too. So he's going to give uh, Shailen another shot at it, I guess. Volkman's got his hands up. Didn't do much there. Tried to hit him. Volkman cut the distance. And Volkman's in mount and has Shailen up against the fence. And he's going to hit Shailen some more. Shailen's going to turtle. Not gonna throw. He's waving it off. He wants no more of Volkman. Very impressive win for Jacob. That kid is tough. Tough kid. And then uh, we got uh, poor Shailen on the on the matches. A little embarrassed. There's our staff checking him out. Uh, looks like maybe uh, Volkman hit him in the knee. Volkman's fists are heavier or harder than than uh, Shailen's knees apparently. Good, good, impressive win by for Volkman. Two seventeen into the first round by tap out by strikes. Jacob Volkman. All right, Volkman on to bigger and better things, and uh, hopefully we'll have him in the April show. Probably have to yeah, pay him a little more. I would, I would, I would, I'd have to. Love to see him.